50 years ago, baby Sally was diagnosed with hip dysplasia. Sally and her parents had to face challenging times. Whilst the medical profession endeavoured to minimise the use of general anaesthetics, it was necessary to anaesthetise Sally while she was fitted with a spiker cast. Sally's treatment lasted six months and she was so young, her rapid growth meant a change of cast every six weeks each new fitting resulting in a traumatic trip to theatre for Mum, Dad and Sally. The plaster itself was impractical, unhygienic and heavy. Repeated cast removal and fittings meant several very stressful experiences for the family. Fast forward 50 years and the world which we inhabit today is almost unrecognisable from the one into which Sally was born. Technology advancement has impacted almost every facet of our lives. Yet sadly, were Sally born today with hip dysplasia, she would face much the same experience as 50 years ago. Same spiker cast. Same costly and distressing treatment. Same impracticalities, weight and hygiene problems. It doesn't have to be this way. Here at Talk2, we've been personally affected by this issue. Ron Taylor's daughter, Caitlin, suffered hip dysplasia as a child and the Talk2 team are committed to changing this experience for sufferers. We have invested thousands of pounds into the development of a new lightweight, practical, hygienic and easy to clean cast. The cast is water resistant and displays impact dampening qualities. It's fair to say that this new spiker is set to revolutionise the way casts are fitted and removed. The cast is reusable, allowing regular fit adjustment throughout the treatment period. Moreover, it will eliminate the need to administer repeated general anaesthetics. And the great news is that unlike its predecessor, this can all be achieved in an outpatient environment. But we need your help in bringing this revolutionary new product to market. This will fundamentally change the experience of hip dysplasia sufferers. With specialist orthopaedic input, we're in the process of building prototypes. Your help will make all the difference, enabling Talk2 to move swiftly to clinical trials of the product in order to alleviate patients' suffering sooner rather than later. Please support us and help us to help people like Sally remember their childhood without all the trauma. We thank you for your support.